Reynolds scholarships have been given out since 1982 and cover all expenses ranging from tuition to room and board to books. It is a prestigious merit-based scholarship that only a very select few individuals receive every year. I was one of the lucky students to be selected for this great opportunity to study at Wake Forest for free. The main thing that being a Reynolds Scholar does is it boosts your respect and prestige from those who know, especially in the classroom setting. How much this affects your prestige all depends on the alloc of the person you ask. It garners respect with a lot of people, especially those who are intellectually minded and adults such as teachers and administrators. Some who are less academically focused than most can see many Reynolds Scholars as nerdy and consider them not as cool. Another factor in how much respect and prestige you gain depends on how they find out. Because if you brag about it, they see you as annoying and too proud. But if they found out in a good way, it normally garners respect for you, especially in the classroom setting. There is definitely a nerdy stereotype, although I feel like our class has begun to change that. However, I don't really have a clear-cut stereotype because the group is just a conglomerate of individuals with no necessary characteristics other than success in the past. We are so different as a group that it is tough to stereotype us. I think of our group as a bunch of people who are very focused on their studies and don't have time for anything else, although I know it's not true in my case and many of the others as well. I think I draw the stereotypes from the responsibilities we have to succeed in all aspects of our life here at Wake Forest. The joking nature of Dave's quote shows the stereotype isn't exactly true. While the Genius Committee, as he lovingly refers to it, is a very intelligent group of people, his use of the word bro shows we are a relatively normal group too. We are much more than the nerdy kids who study 24-7. Getting a full ride to college was not only a goal of mine, but my parents as well. They worked very hard alongside me to get me where I am today, and I'm glad that I can make them proud. They were probably most excited they didn't have to pay for college, as was I. It is nice to know that I'm helping the family by going to school for free. Although I must admit I do use it to get them to buy me things on occasion. While it was great to receive the scholarship, we all know my work here isn't done. We are all excited for the opportunities I have. I have learned many of my values from my parents, and that is evident in our shared ideas about the opportunities that are available to me with this scholarship. I am very proud to be a part of the group, but sometimes I don't consider myself worthy to be in the group due to the incredible opportunities it provides and what it says about the community's faith in me. It is difficult because the expectations are different for each person, but the only benchmark I have is to compare myself to other people. It is tough to separate myself and judge based solely on my goals and actions rather than those of my peers. Being in the group has definitely made me more confident in myself, but it is tough at times to know I have so many expectations and so many people to impress. I chose to be a Reynolds Scholar for the same reason everyone else chose it, I assume, to get money to go to college, as well as the opportunities it presents for us. Our reasons for joining never fully encompass the advantages of the group, because it is impossible to know all the opportunities it provides for us until we have experienced it firsthand. The values it stresses such as leadership, dedication, and hard work are ones I try to adhere to in my everyday life. Therefore, it was a pretty easy transition from hoping to be a part of the group and adapting once I was a member. The Reynolds Scholarship is a reward for years of hard work. I wanted to be a recipient, but it was the committee that ultimately decided to offer me a scholarship, which solidified my place as a Reynolds Scholar. It makes me more proud to think that they were able to acknowledge my hard work and believe in me as much as I do. Unlike the full-ride kids at other universities, the Reynolds Scholars here really try to make a name for themselves in other ways, by being active in the community, on campus, and in the classroom. We realize the prestige of the title of Reynolds Scholar gives us, but we look to make other people remember us in ways besides just being a scholarship kid. The Reynolds Scholarship opens up opportunities, but it is up to us to go out and get them. 
I think we do a pretty good job of becoming involved throughout campus, which makes us members of other groups first, while still remaining a Reynolds Scholar at heart. Ultimately, I hope to bring my own personality to the legacy of the Reynolds Scholars here at Wake. I don't want to conform to the old stereotypes, I want to be my own person. I want to be the Dow Harmon Reynolds Scholar, not Reynolds Scholar Dow Harmon. While it is a big part of my life, I don't want it defining who I am.